Hi Miss Cats, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lara Tomato. If you are new on this channel, welcome. And if you have been on this channel before, but you haven't already subscribed, like sis, what are you waiting for? Do the right thing, subscribe, comment, share, and give this video a thumbs up. So, all right, guys. So today we woke up to the sad news, that, aka, uh, and I'd like to acknowledge his passing and his his uh, contribution to the SA hip hop music or just SA's music in general. I get it. So yeah, my condolences to Cairo and his whole family. This is literally just like sad, like. Hey, we we are in the times of danger. Kore, Kore, you'll never know when it's your turn. Like it could literally be any day, any minute, any second from now. You'll never know. So let's just appreciate our life and be careful. Be careful. Be careful, guys. Like who should be out there? Like this country is no longer safe. The justice system is just um just failing us like the whole system in general is just failing us so yeah uh my condolences to aka and his whole family and also guys i've been going through the most linda i've um my baby cousin passed away he decided to already know what it's like you know decided to already know this life thing is not for him and yeah he did what he had to do he felt like he had to do at that moment or you know so it just has been a very difficult week for me honestly like yo i have never experienced um a death like like so close to me like this like some like such a random death actually let me not say it close to me because my grandmother passed away last year but it was like so expected because she was like hundred and something years old um but this one ashem i like i get it like for the first time i get or like what death does to someone like like i language so yeah it is what it is so we're just going to move on and just appreciate what god has done in our lives and appreciate like the life that we have and yeah just take care of ourselves and our body and it's just ironic because i'm saying take care of your body but i will be <laughs> san jaja so yeah, rest in peace to AKA and Tabang Matu. So yeah, we're just going to get right into this. Today's video, like I told you, or you know, Mugozi. I mean, I love people's not misfortune, but Mugozi. Like Iskaka Samoto. Like I enjoy Iskaka Sabato. So we have Iskaka. Like this one. Today's gata is all about, like, it's so juicy. It's all about, like, don't trust anyone. Like, don't. And it's just going to be, like, three scenarios. And then, yeah, we're going to take it from there. It's just, like, alrighty. So, the first scenario, the first uh, gata. <laughs> Other one area. I hope I'm not too close to the camera. So, the other one are um... Yeah, no makeup, no filter. It is what it is. Say uh. Quebec. All right, the other one are uh, the first one are and dear anonymous. I want to pour out my heart. I hate my best friend, but it's not intentionally. Life, yeah, my best friend is what I've always dreamed of. My best friend has uh, always had things go right in her life, while I struggle and it makes me feel small and I just hate her. The time she fell pregnant, she had to drop out of school and her baby daddy left her i was so happy Kiri, she will suffer a few months after she found a guy the guy has businesses he took care of her she graduated and after she graduated she got a job the man married her this year march and she's living a lavish life being with her is torture like being her is like torture i feel like just strangling her i'm just translating for those that don't speak 
Uh, a few months ago, I put Mulemo in her car or a hour accident and Nesserole or Munna Amutorele Asale a Sotlera instead, making Kiki and Anna Anning a Ovala as he drove her car for it to be serviced. Okay. A few months ago, I'm shining, I'm hot. A few months ago, she, this lady, she put juju. I think if I say juju, everyone will understand. She put like, uh, you know, spell or curses on the friend's car so that the friend can have an accident. But because like God is God, like he cannot, <laughs> we don't play, we don't play with God, like cannot play with God. So because God is God, he's like, no, you know, the, she, the friend is not the one that's going to get hurt, but the mechanic. Okay, so Arang, um, instead of having the car fixed, her husband bought her a new car for the birthday. Okay, instead of having the car fixed, her husband bought her a new car for the best, for her birthday. I was so ashamed to be, uh, to... To get in the car as she asked me to take a ride with her. She is now pregnant with her second child. She is now pregnant with the second child. I just like wonder why is she still alive? Or my best friend. Like best friend. This is literally the definition of don't trust anyone. She's busy saying my best friend. But she wants that best friend to die. Fix your heart. Like, this lady has gone too far. I don't think that even if she tries to cancel the, 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 the jealousy. Because honestly speaking, we all have jealousy. We all uh, can feel jealousy. But you, you deal with it. As soon as it enter, you acknowledge or is, am I feeling jealousy? Is this the feeling that I'm feeling right now jealousy? And if yes... You deal with it. You like born. You you not you not doing this to me because jealousy honestly hurts you more than it hurts the next person or the person that you're jealous of. So check yourself. So you've literally become muloi. Like your friend's success or your friend's happiness made you transformed you to muloi. Yeah, the things we do, well not we, the things people do. Like yo, know, and it's not just hair. Like. Like it's just a story for another day. The things that we hear, yo guys, Anyway, like chipiki chipi, whether makeup or no makeup, or whether it's logical vaseline or not. Retarding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Let me find another one. Yo, 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 yo. Give me one good reason why you don't get to song. I've been listening to AKA songs the whole day. Like, <sighs> okay. Found it. Found it. The second one. Are Hey, guys. Yo, guys. South Africans. We can never write English in Shay. We have to mix. The other one. Are Hi, guys. I got it. Um. I'm a 27 years old girl who is unemployed and the mother of two. When I was in high school, I was in 2020. Post pandemic, I met this gent and we hit it off at the same time. He told me he was married, but for some weird reason, that made him more charming. Side note the gent is really moneyed, and I saw him as a who as a who. Pela Quinking Azami, just like any other married man. He didn't have time for me, and I doubt he even loved me until I had to do what any woman who is desperate would do. Okay, I'll translate when I'm done with this one because it's sham. Mugel decided to balance Zulu. On my side, so. Avangani 
when I started doing as I was told, indo dayakala yes wangam. Yaishia kwa sani. Okay guys, I'm ready ne. Like, I'm ready. So, kutuwa la sizulika speed. Yaishia kwa sani just to be with me. Kwa manje, kwa manje. So, si kulu ma yonza. Kwa manje, si kulu ma yonza. Abantua na wami boba bili. Regret has now kicked in. Ngoba. Unko siga azi wake is fighting for divorce. Sengi kabanga izi ngani. Sengi kabanga izi ngani zake izi zo la shekelwa. Awazali who lived together and who were once happily married. I am caught in between ukuyeka ingi kwanzayo and risk losing konke kotwa. Another part of me says yangi suke la yona lendo da ebe ishadile. Nkela ninga bonise. Okay. Nini bonise. So bonise ni kia. Alright. So this lady, she's 27 years old. She has two kids and she met this married man post a pandemic. And then she decided to both of them, they've decided to just uh, cheat on this lady, on the wife, on the husband's wife. And then uh, the guy... Uh, the lady decided, the, the side chick decided that, you know what? Yes, this guy does not love me, and but I want him to take care of my kids. My kids, not his kids. I want him to take care of my kids. So I'm going to look for uh, uh, Sangoma, a traditional doctor who's going to do a spell, a love spell on this guy. So, and then the friends decided, Izzy Chomi, decided to like uh, direct the side chick. Or, you know what? I know this you know and then the guy started neglecting his responsibility his responsibilities he started neglecting everything started neglecting the wife he started neglecting his own kids and started taking care of their side trick because now he's not thinking properly he's not thinking correctly because of the love spell that the lady, the side chick has put on him. So now, Miguel is like, what should I do? Because now the wife is filing for divorce. I feel guilty. I'm regretting. But I hope that this, his kids, his kids are going to grow up without the, both the parents being in the same house. And they were once happy before she got in and then did her own things. So now she's like, what should I do? Like, what did you think was going to happen? Like, you can't, like, like, the way men are so careless. Like, the way men are so careless. Like, people are desperate out there. And then, you guys just, like, men, men, like, because they will just go unbothered Guru Usan Miji and decided to ruin their own lives like she, he literally just ruined his own life he doesn't even know it because he's not thinking properly he's just thinking oh, my wife oh. but he literally just ruined his own life but anyway I get like a I get a trauma I get a baby I get a me puto, me puto na na gadi pipi guys, me puto na na gadi pipi. Men, the downfall of every man is a woman, like multiple women. Ah, uh, when I join number side, but out trivula. Like women are desperate out there. Like who should be like guys? Like I will call right langa pande. Hmm, hmm. Oh, sneery. The shamag no go with shamag. Okay, I'm gonna look for another one. There's supposed to be three. Give me one good reason why you get the so one thing about Savanani. I come an office office. A very good function. So the third scenario, or, or 
Please hide my identity. I'm a 33 years old. Please hide. So, did you check out your song? Oh, guys. Uh, I beg. Hearing I beg, one thing about me, I will beg that I beg. <laughs> Another one are please hide my identity. I am 33 and I have three kids. I work as a teacher in Nimbop and my husband works at Gauteng. We have uh, been together for 17 years. Last year, December, I went to Gauteng just like every holiday. When I arrived there, I realized that he lost some weight and he has some sores on his mouth and scars all over his body. Uh, first day, I thought maybe it's flu because he told me he was not feeling well. He didn't use we didn't use protection the first day because he didn't have condoms and I trusted him because I never thought he could have any disease. My husband is my <laughs> my husband is the loyal kind. My husband is the loyal kind, or I thought until after two weeks I started feeling bad. Headaches, running stomach and chest pain. I went to the clinic and somehow ended up testing for HIV. And the results were positive. I was shocked. I was advised to tell him so that he can do the test also. I was brave enough to tell him and he was not shocked at all. He accepted my status and promised me that he will support me. Quite the devil himself. Yeah, <laughs> Ganjani. Ganjani. Support me, Ganjani, if you know that when I don't have a okay. Anyway, Ari, but the problem is that he does not want you to get tested. I'm, I'm asking myself, did he knew his status before he slept with me? Or he is just ignorant or in denial. I've accepted my status and I don't have any problem with it. I know what to do. I did my research and I don't want to concentrate on bad stigma towards this virus. I have forgiven myself for having unprotected sex with my husband. I have to be strong for our kids and take treatment. I guess I trusted the wrong person. Support me for what? Support me for... Like, I feel like, Lue, now there must be something that you've been doing before. Unless you're just like... Ignorant or... Not even ignorant, like... Unsupport a juang. Unsupport a juang. What do you mean, support me? Like, if I know, and I know, and I know that I'm not having unprotected sex, but I'm not having sex at all with anyone. When... I'm having sex with that one person who's supposed to be my husband. Guys. <laughs> when I know that this guy is the one that infected me, like, because I've not been faithful to you. So how is it that when you just act like, mm, I'm HIV positive as if you got it from, from a mosquito. Like, who don't put our kids in a guy HIV? Who don't put our kids in a guy? Support me for what? Who don't put our kids in a guy HIV? Or when we get a guy on Payon? Ongisha. Who don't put our own support? Like, we're not going to get a so. Like, I honestly believe that if I know who infected me with HIV and they behave like they knew all along, what long has a wall? Like, if you are my husband for 17 years, you, I'm not supposed to be HIV positive. If you're not cheating, and I'm not cheating, if you're both faithful, like, just have the common decency to just use protection, guys. If you feel like you're going to leave, like, leave your marriage and do things with other people and give other people your private, like, use protection. I don't to Shut up, guys. I'll see you in my next upload. I love you so much. Please give this video a thumbs up. I love you. Bye.